Turtles three among our swarms. Okay, now let's talk about worms one by one. First, where do they live? I so sleep on the ground where it is dark and day. Mm -hmm. And during the day, where do they mostly stay? During the day, our swarms mostly stay in their rooms underground. Mm -hmm. Aha, I see. And how about at night? At night, they come up near or to surface to eat. That's right. Great. And and do you know how worms move and how many rings do they have? Our swarms have over 100 of these rings. And how do they move? They move stretching and squeezing. Squeezing? What? Squeezing of these? Of these rings. Uh -huh, I see. Okay, next. Now we talk about what they eat. Can you tell me what do they eat? A worm is just about anything that can fit in its mouth, leaves, logs, fruits, and then animals. Mm -hmm. How is it good for the earth? They convert all of these things into rich soil. Mm -hmm. That's why it is good for the earth. Okay, next. That is the natural enemy of earthworms. What is that? It's birds. For they have great eyesight. eyesight. So. When the worms come up, the worms can see them from far away. And how do they eat the worms? They eat the worms by pulling it from the ground. Mm -hmm. Next. They earthworms help. Worms plants grow by making the source of the energy. Mm -hmm. So, farmers and gardeners love earthworms. Why? Because, because they are good for plants flowers and and crops. That's right. Very good. And now uh, rainy days for earthworm. Earthworms really love rainy days. Why? Earthworms breathe through their skin in skin which stays which must stay moist. That's right. And why they come out of the ground on rainy days? Therefore rainy days are the perfect time to see earthworms. To, 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 what you to, to look for to look for new place to live. That's right. So this is all about the story about earthworm. Thank you for your great information and your presentation. Yeah, thank you for listening. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye.